more industry has been crucial to the economic growth in Malaysia. Malaysia is the second largest palm oil producer in the world, contributing 27% to the global palm oil production after Indonesia. 50 to 75 million meter cube of palm oil mill effluent home, are generated in Malaysia annually from the palm oil extraction, washing, and cleaning process. Palm has a high organic content which leads to high BOD and COD. Thus, pose the possibility of algae bloom due to nutrients from the organic content and threaten the aquatic life. Conventional method of treating palm using ponding system or land application techniques are deemed inefficient. Although the palm oil industry contributed to the economic growth in Malaysia, the current palm oil production is not sustainable for the environment in the long term period as production of palm oil continues to increase. In order to achieve the Sustainable Development Goal 12, Responsible Consumption and Production, we suggest that palm oil mills utilize the palm as a resource rather than a waste to convert it to biogas for generating electricity or as a fuel source. How is POM converted into biogas? POM is pretreated to achieve the required parameter to enter an enclosed biodigester, which includes the removal of fibers and dirt, adjustment of pH, and reduction of temperature of the POM. Anaerobic digestion occurs in the biodigester and produces biogas, which consists mainly of methane and carbon dioxide and trace amounts of hydrogen sulfide. The biogas is then sent to a hydrogen sulfide scrubber to reduce its concentration below 200 ppm. The moisture content of the scrub biogas is then reduced using a biogas dehumidifier to optimize the combustion process, prevent condensation, and to protect the engine from acid formation. The treated biogas is then supplied into a gas engine which converts energy contained in the biogas to mechanical energy to drive the generator or as a fuel source to a boiler to generate heat and electricity. By converting POM to biogas, greenhouse gases emission can be reduced as conventional method of POM treatment result in methane emission to the atmosphere and may cause groundwater contamination. Capturing methane is significant in combating climate change as methane has a 31 times global warming potential in a 100 year period due to its high efficiency in trapping heat per molecule when compared to carbon dioxide. To align with Sustainable Development Goal 12, the conversion of POM to biogas promotes the circular economy model in the palm oil industry. The biogas plants creates job opportunities and increases the efficient use of the POM as usable energy for the mill and even to the surrounding infrastructures while making profits out of it. For example, FGV Holdings Berhad's biogas plant in its Triang Palm Oil Mill in Bera Pahang was able to produce up to 10 million kilowatt hour of electricity from POM during its peak transmission, which is equivalent to a revenue of 5 million ringgit per year for the palm oil mill. Even the byproduct from the biodigester, BioSlurry, can be sold to palm oil plantation as it is enriched with organic digestate, which is a perfect substitute for chemical fertilizers which are usually toxic and may cause food poisoning. Thus, target 12.4, 12.5, 12.6 and 12.8 of SDG 12 can be achieved via conversion of POM to biogas, as it not only drives the economic growth, but also promotes a sustainable palm oil mill. One can't ignore the important role a chemical engineer plays in converting POM into energy through biogas. This includes designing and continuous monitoring of the plant for the overall process from cradle to grave to make sure it is balanced in terms of economic, environmental, and social aspects. Besides, they can also be committed to professional committees to exchange ideas and generate better designs for the whole palm oil mill players to benefit from it. The Russia-Ukraine war has disrupted the supply of sunflower oil from Ukraine, which causes the Malaysia palm oil exports to increase even more in the near future. Thus, it is important to make sure that the production and consumption is done in a responsible way, so that palm oil does not only gives us a developed future, but ensures the future generation has a sustainable future as well.